Hello, everybody. Andrea Majewski here with Dental L Mobile Hygiene. So if you've had your teeth whitened with me the past couple months, you would have been given, um, if you had wanted it, um, this whitening toothpaste. Okay, so it's amazing stuff. I love it. And this is the stuff that I do use every day. Um, but just a quick reminder, for it to work, make sure to not rinse your toothbrush. So you just want to put it on your um, toothbrush, but don't use any water, brush your teeth for a good two minutes and it will work. This stuff is amazing um, because the whitening that I do offer you, it does work right away. But you will see it um, brighten even more after about three days to a week, depending on your stain level now. And this toothpaste helps to get um, your teeth as white as your teeth can go. Because what a lot of times people don't tell you is that everybody's teeth, everybody's enamel has a whitening point. So even if you want like chiclet white teeth, your enamel might not get that far. Everyone's teeth has that sort of um, end point, okay? But with the toothpaste, it does, it does help you to kind of get even further without having to constantly whiten using hydrogen peroxide because that's what whitens the teeth. There's a mix of um, carbon peroxide and hydrogen peroxide. That's what I use. Um, but this stuff is amazing to just sort of help you get further to that point. But make sure to use it every single day. Twice a day if you can. Even three times a day would be perfect. But if your teeth are cold sensitive now, you, you um, want to be using like a Sensodyne or a pro enamel type of toothpaste at nighttime. So use the whitening in the morning, but then use your um, Sensodyne or Pro Enamel toothpaste at night. So then that way it's it sits on the teeth all night to help against the cold sensitivity. So this doesn't actually cause the teeth to become cold sensitive again, but it doesn't help with it either. But um, as an example, like Pro Enamel or Sensodyne actually helps to cover up those um, exposed nerves of the teeth to prevent sensitivity. So you can use them both because this toothpaste doesn't actually cause sensitivity as a lot of them do. So be careful. Um, there are a lot of toothpaste out there that actually make the teeth more cold sensitive. So if you need help with knowing which toothpaste to pick, just ask me anytime. I am more than happy to help you because I, I don't like to mention names of, you know, bad toothpaste companies. I don't like to do that, especially online, but I would be happy to help you. So let me know if you have any questions. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys very, very soon.